formidable, expressive eyes, grumpy facial countenance, and a compact, muscular body that moves with stealth and precision to ambush its hapless prey. This tenacious and self-reliant creature is one of the least studied wildcats in the world. With its enigmatic, seldom-witnessed demeanor, coupled with the extraordinary physical attributes that make it a subject of intrigue, this elusive feline thrives amidst one of the Earth's harshest landscapes, where perpetual snow freezes all in its wake. However, this exceptional predator effortlessly inhabits this unforgiving terrain, as if it were born to conquer it. Meet the ice-cold killer of the barren expanse, the Palasis Cat. Autocolobus Manul, or simply Manul, is a fascinating small wild cat that was initially documented in 1776 by Peter Simon Pallas, who encountered this intriguing feline near Lake Baikal, the largest freshwater lake in the world by volume in Russia. With its Greek origins, the scientific name of the Pallas's cat, Autocolobus, translates to ugly-eared. Peter Pallas, upon initial description, mistakenly believed it to be the ancestor of the domestic Persian cat due to its sturdy physique, long fur, and flattened face. Since its discovery, the Pallas's cat has been observed across a vast region in Central Asia. Although it's found in widely dispersed locations, its ranges stretch from the Caucasus to the west, near the Caspian Sea, to the Iranian Plateau, Hindu Kush, sections of the Himalayas, Tibetan Plateau, and the Altai Sayan region, and South Siberian mountains as well, of course, where it thrives in regions with consistently shallow snow cover at about six to eight inches, and it remains elusive to casual observation. While some people adore their fluffy appearance, they don't rank among the world's sweetest or most cuddly creatures. In a revealing anecdote recounted by Bill Swanson, the Cincinnati Zoo's director of animal research, zookeepers found the kittens growling and hissing at each other, remarkably even before they had opened their eyes. This is because of the enigmatic felines possessing a solitary nature, often disliking the company of anyone, even their own kind. Consequently, it is not uncommon for them to establish residence at a considerable distance from their peers, sometimes up to three miles apart. What's more, with an expanse of 38 square miles, it's possible to find a population of about four to eight cats, rendering them renowned for their elusive tendencies. Fortunately, despite their intense demeanor and aggression, these creatures are relatively small in size, limiting the extent of harm that they can inflict upon humans. The worst-case scenario involving an encounter with a Pallas's cat would mirror the aftermath of an encounter with an enraged domestic or feral cat, including numerous scratches, rarely severe bites that need prompt medical attention. But still, they do show aggression, like this grumpy manual attacking a visitor's camera even from inside its cage. Despite being amongst the least studied cats in the wild, Pallas's cat has not escaped the scrutiny of scientific exploration. Through meticulous analysis of nuclear DNA, phylogenetic research of this species has suggested that the Pallas's cat diverged genetically from a common ancestor it shared with the Prionellurus genus approximately 8.5 to 4.8 million years ago. Adding to the intrigue, experts have made another discovery that the Pallas's cat, although distantly related, may have kinship with the leopard cat, hinting at an intricate tapestry of feline evolution that extended across vast periods. With its notorious reputation as the grumpiest cat in the world, this particular cat possesses a truly imposing appearance. Its light gray fur, captivating in itself, showcases an array of delicate, pale, yellowish ochre tones, accompanied by striking white and blackish tips. Moving upward, the forehead and top of its head boast a light gray hue, while the cheeks are graced by two elegant black zigzag lines that elegantly stretch from the corners of its eyes all the way to its jaw joints. Palace's cats, despite their outward appearance of being large and heavy due to their long, thick coats and stocky builds, are actually quite similar in size to that of domestic cats. Their seemingly robust stature is further enhanced by the soft and dense fur that they possess, boasting an impressive count of approximately 58,000 hairs per square inch. But they measure only between 18 to 26 inches in length from head to body, and they possess a tail that ranges from 8.3 to 12.2 inches. Moreover, these grumpy felines weigh approximately 6 to 10 pounds, with a rounded skull, featuring a short nasal bone. Interestingly, its legs are relatively shorter than all other feline species as compared to its body stature, and are accompanied by short and sharp retractile claws. Adding to the striking set of attributes, these formidable felines have the signature low-set rounded ears. This particular ear structure goes beyond mere aesthetics, allowing these cats to peer over objects effortlessly 
without the need to depress their ears. Consequently, only a small portion of their head, located above its eyes, is revealed. This unique characteristic not only grants them a remarkable advantage in their environment, but it also lends an air of ferocity and restlessness to their faces, further enhancing their distinctive appeal. Furthermore, their captivating appearance is accentuated by their eyes, which are encircled by white fur. The iris of Pallas' cats is yellowish in color, and when exposed to sunlight, their pupils contract into small circular discs. As a carnivorous predator, the Pallas' cat possesses distinctive feline teeth. Its lower carnassials are exceptionally powerful, measuring three times the length of those found in domestic cats, while the upper carnassials are short and robust. Impressively, the cat exerts a bite force at 155.4 newtons at the canine tip. But it does not stop there. To put this into perspective, scientists have developed a metric called the bite force quotient, which compares the bite force with the size of the animal. In the case of the Pallas' cat, its bite force quotient reaches an impressive value of 113.8, surpassing even some of the most fearsome predators in the animal kingdom, including brown bears, cheetahs, and cougars. However, known for their expertise in hunting small mammals, Pallas' cats have a specialized diet primarily consisting of small rodents and pikas. Additionally, their menu may encompass a range of prey, such as mouse hares, murines, ground squirrels, voles, small birds, grasshoppers, and lizards. With its keen hunting instincts, the Pallas' cat employs various techniques to capture its prey. Whether by stealthily stalking or strategically ambushing near the exits of its burrows, this feline predator seizes its opportunities with precision. Yet the Phallus' cat hunting repertoire extends beyond mere stealth and ambush tactics. Astonishingly, it's been observed utilizing its tail as a mesmerizing, twitching motion, effectively captivating the attention of potential prey. This subtle, hypnotic dance keeps the unsuspecting victim spellbound just long enough for the Pallas to inch closer, ready to pounce. However, despite its hunting prowess, the Pallas cat possesses a compact body that hinders its running abilities. As a result, instead of relying on speed to evade danger, this cunning predator seeks refuge in small crevasses, or crevices, I suppose, or seeks shelter near boulders where it can wait patiently until the threat dissipates. Similarly, when a prey manages to escape its initial ambush, the palace cat does not engage in lengthy chases. Instead, it quickly shifts its focus and scans its surrounding for another potential target, transitioning from one opportunity to the next, maximizing its chances of securing a successful hunt. This remarkable behavior showcases the palace's cat's hunting prowess in a snowy landscape. With calculated movements, it gracefully maneuvers through the brown-colored grass, flawlessly blending into its surroundings. However, the cat's short legs, ideal for concealment, proved to be a hindrance in the deep snow, slowing down to its already deliberate pace. Therefore, as the palace cat approaches its target, the wild rodent senses its presence and swiftly darts away, leaving the cat unable to give chase. However, the cat patiently waits and readies itself in another attempt knowing that there are numerous rodents in the nearby burrows. In the wintry landscapes, the palace cat's paws grow colder the longer it remains on the snow. To alleviate this discomfort, the cat cleverly balances itself on its fluffy tail, using its warm platform for a respite. Both males and females of the species mark their territories, delineating their exclusive domains. However, their encounters with one another are brief, occurring only during the mating season from December to March. During this time, the males diligently trail the females for several days, possibly acting as protectors against rival suitors. Following successful breeding, the female undergoes a gestation period lasting approximately 9 to 10 weeks, resulting in the birth of 3 to 6 adorable kittens every year. While this species encounters the natural threats posed by foxes, eagles, and other top predators in the food chain, the most significant peril it faces stems from the widespread poisoning of vole and pika populations that serve as vital prey items for palaces' cats. The repercussions of such a large-scale poisoning campaigns are dire, potentially leading to the local extinction of this already scarce species. As per the latest assessment by the IUCN Red List, the total population size of Pallas' cats stands at 58,000 mature individuals. Despite the distressing decline in their numbers, the current classification of the species remains as least concern on the IUCN Red List. Nevertheless, urgent conservation efforts are imperative to reverse the declining trend and safeguard the future of these enigmatic felines.